So performing this exercise test can be great for people of all ages. We can measure their aerobic fitness level and we can provide some confirmation if they're doing well or a little bit of motivation if they're on the lower end. Hey music students, my name's Josh Bovard and I'm a PhD student in the School of Kinesiology. And I'm here today with Pat and he's coming in to test in my lab here at the Chan Gun Pavilion where we're gonna get Pat on the bike and he's gonna cycle as hard as he can and we're gonna measure some of how his body works during exercise. My experience is that it's really important to balance all the things that we do in music. We work hard on our instruments, we study, but we've also got to take care of our bodies. So for me, that's always meant exercise. I've got to try and get into the gym and I've got to make the best of the time that I have there. So being able to do a test like this can really help me to focus and make sure I'm doing the right kind of exercise for the time that I have and for what my body needs. When we're doing the test, we can give you a sense of really how hard you can work during exercise. So if you only have 15 minutes in between your practice sessions and you need to get out for a power walk, we can give you some perspective on how hard you want to go during that 15 minute power walk to really benefit from exercise. Exercise does a couple of things for me mentally. It's a time when I can set my mind free so I can really focus on getting my body to do the work, but it's also a good time for me to think about things that I'm working on, whether it's a piece of music or a problem at work. Uh, and it's really a great stress reliever. I also find that I sleep much better when I've had a good day of exercise. Keep going, keep going, come on. Another minute here, keep going. Big circles, go, 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 come on. Keep going, keep going. And good. So Pat did pretty darn well. Uh, as he exercised and the intensity went up, his VO2 went up, and cardiorespiratory fitness is one of the strongest predictors of morbidity and mortality, i.e. the higher your fitness level, the healthier and the longer you're gonna live. Really, this is my wake up call to try and get myself back into a good routine. Because a good routine, it's like practicing or doing your term papers, you have to have a good routine, you have to lay down a base, you have to use that when times get tough, that if you need to take a day off, you're okay because you've got everything in order. So it's all part of a plan to be the best that you can be and keep balance in your life.